Uh, I'm joined here by John O'Meara, who is the manager of the Six Mile Bridge team, and uh, of course Six Mile Bridge are in the county final. Uh, John, thanks for coming and talking to us, first of all. Uh, John, this is your fifth year as, as manager, and at that time you've managed to win two senior titles, and you've also managed to win a, a, a cup, which is a fair achievement, and we're back in the final again now. Uh, yeah, look, I suppose um, you know we, we, we've had a we've had a good run of it um, over in the, the end of 2012, um, in time for the, the 2013 season. Um, I suppose look, we're lucky enough to um, have a very good bunch of players at present in the ridge. Um, you know they've come out of the, the 421 championships we won at the early part of the decade, and that, that those four championships were backbone by the obviously the 516 that we won in the in the last decade. You know, so we're very lucky, and look, we, we have a great bunch, and sure, you know we're just trying to capitalise on. on Bunch of presents, you know. Yeah, that experience you have, you had to use it this year, uh, particularly it was against the, in Belly, the Bellier game, and your neighbours up the road there yeah. gave you uh, everything at you, in fact. Yeah, look, uh, you know, the, the, there's, there's so little between a lot of teams in, um, in Clare um, because, you know, uh, the 16 senior teams, and on any given day, any one of the teams can, can, can beat the other, and I suppose we've seen that really with. You know the last two teams that have been relegated have been in the previous year semi-finals. Like so, there's very little between um, success and, and, and failure. Um, you know, and the championship is so tight. Like there's been 11 um, different winners over the last um, you know 16 or 17 years, uh, which is a huge, huge um, credit to the standard of the of the championship. You know, um, look, I suppose we, you know we're we're just focusing in on the next game the whole time. Um, you know, we've had a good run, we had a good win over Clarecast in the first round. Now we into the summer break, and you know, we came out of that well, and you know we had a huge challenge in face, and obviously the All Ireland Club finalists in, in, in round two, and we were lucky enough to come out of that, and good result over Cracklow, and then you know into I suppose the business end of it, the last day in the market, and you know it could have went any way for a finish, it was nip and tuck, and um, you know they had to run us for a while in the in the first half. Uh, we were we were lucky enough I suppose to go in level at um, at half time, yeah. um, you know, and we, we regrouped and we had a chat and. You know, we came out. We played reasonably well in the second half. I thought, and we, we you know, we closed the game out well um, for for a finish, and we got over the line. And look, the semi-finals are for winning. You know, they're a they're a, they're a mechanism to get into a final, and you know, everything is geared now for for, for the final on on uh, Sunday the fifteenth. Yeah, uh, Claire bowed out maybe a bit earlier than we thought it would. So, with the inter-county players you have here, does it make it a little bit easier then to get lads together? Or? Ah, I don't know. Look, uh, you know, we're 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 blessed with the with the. With the here, you know, they're all savage committed to the um, to, to, to the club and to, to this group. Um, you know, and they would have been available, um, you know, for the majority of cup games and also for for challenge games. And they'd always be um, in and around training. Um, you know, and look, I suppose certainly it, it, it helped. Any time your county players come back, it does re-energise you. You know, and it re-energises the lads that have been training all along. Um, you know, so yeah, look, it's it's uh, great to get them back when we did. Yeah, you were involved in all aspects of Six Mile Bridge, John. I remember a few years back I was looking for you, I think, and I heard that you were going up route and cutting trees for hurlers or something like that. <laughs> um, look, I suppose, um, look, we, we have a great club here, um, Nicholas, which we're all very, very proud of. Um, you know, and it's a, a great club to be part of. Um, you know, and I suppose it's the, the, like, okay, it happens that I'm involved in the senior team at present. Um, look, I'd be as happy if it was an under 16 team I'd be involved in, it doesn't matter to me. Um, it's about just, you know, that's the position I have now. Um, but it is, look, there's a lot of huge um, work goes in here on, 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 on the club side. You know, we've, we've a great underage um, structure. Um, you know, we're constantly trying to improve the facilities. Um, you know, we're hoping to get our, our indoor hurling arena up maybe within the next um, um, two years. And look, we, we, we constantly need to move with the times because, um, you know, we've grown population. Um, you know, you might look at the last instance and you'll see. Um, the, the, the rate, the population of Six Mile Bridge has grown at, and uh, you know we need to meet the demands of that. Um, you know we need to keep ahead of the of, of the ball game and, and provide for the young people of the of the parish. Yeah, and it was finally what, the game itself. What kind of a challenge do you think will be hopefully posed by Clooney Quinn? Yeah, Clooney's going to prove. Look, we, we saw again. We, we saw um, you know we've seen all their games this year. I, I've been uh, looking enough. I've been to lots of championship matches this year. Um, seen Clooney on a, on a few occasions, um, you know, and I suppose the last day in Clonara we saw the real quality and look, the huge experience, um, you know, in, 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 in the form of you know, the Connor Harrisons and the Fergal Lynches, like they've been around the block uh, yeah. a, a long, long time, but I suppose, look, it's really the, the talent in, in the team is huge as well, like Peter Douglas, probably the preeminent hurler in, in Clare at present, and I suppose he's carried his form from the day he was introduced again in Tipperary um, in, into the club championship, um, you know, and then we've 
you have young fellas then like say Ryan Taylor who, who poses a huge threat as well. Um, you know, probably knocking on the door of the Clare senior team next year. You know, and then young Ronald O'Donnell in the corner who has really lit up the championship with, with, with the scores. You know, so look, it's up to us to be ready for for we, we can only control our own performance and you know we need to be ready um, for the challenge that Clooney are, are want to to um, bring and uh, we'd be determined to, to meet that head on. Um, you know. And, Whoever wins it, fair play, and if we win it, great, and if they only win it, we'll shake their hand, and they'll, 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 they'll be in the best team in the championship um, if, if they go on and win it, and likewise we will. Yeah. John, I think there's about 30 uh, fully fit men out there waiting for you to go to train and for, for another training session tonight. Uh, that's tough going, I suppose, to, to manage all those guys. Uh, yeah, but look, it's, 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 great. it's a great time to be, um, you know, I always said to uh, um, you know, any lads, I said, look, you know, if we're training, when the when, when the lights are required, you're doing something right, and thankfully we are. Yeah, yeah. Uh, th thanks very much, John, for talking. It's great to be here on Six Way Bridge tonight, and, and we look forward to seeing you trotting out there in Cusick Park. Perfect. And we look forward to the no game. Better. More thanks, than really, John. No better. Thanks very much. You got started anyway. We're doing it. I, I just want.